Thank you, everybody. Simon Albert. Lovely to see you. May I say what lovely hair and shoes you have? Thank you. Are you forgetting something? Though? Oh, I'm sorry. I meant to compliment you on your breasts. Thank also. you. That's hey, your doing. shoes actually are fantastic. They're, they're pretty nice, right? Wow. They're yeah. kind of like, oh, yeah. my eyes. And then the subtlety of the socks, you know, really. Yeah, no, I, I, I like down. it. You're quite a snappy dresser. I, I, you see, I always assume that you'd be like your character, but you're nothing like that. You're no. No. Yeah. Thank God. It's very easy to be cooler than him, though. though. Yeah. Not... Well, they, they don't do. There's not a lot of cool goes on in the characters in that show. No. But it's a very good show. Thank you. Yeah. Thank yeah. you. Yeah. Yeah. No. Very, very good. No, it is. You're upsetting. Yeah. 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 All right. Let's save it a bit. You know. He's. <laughs> you're not overdo it. You'll get your twenty bucks. <laughs> You're playing back the amount of applause they gave you for your show. In the yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. I mean, like, I, I work here all night. I get the same amount as yeah. you. You just turn up. Johnny come lately. You got a round of applause. Does it seem, seem fair to me? I have a big family. You know? Yeah, yeah, I, yeah. So, uh, what's the haps then? What's going on? What's uh, going on with your... Uh, how'd you get your hair to do that? Uh, <clears throat> well... It's, it was a solo project. I was, uh, I was at work and I showered. This is like an hour ago. Wow. Uh, yeah. So your hair's still wet? Uh, it is the appearance of being, because I have a spray that makes it look wet. So I don't even really have to shower. Wow. I can trick people by just spray it all spray over Spray it all over body your body and you're done. Be like, you know. Do you do a lot of uh, water sport activity? Uh, no, yes, no, I don't, uh, I, don't, I don't do water sports. I, I would swim at uh, Stephen S. Wise Jewish camp. Yes. Um, really <laughs> aggressive, aggressive swimming team. Um, now, what makes uh, 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 an aggressive swimming team as opposed to just the guys who like to swim? Little Jews. <laughs> <laughs> really fierce, fast, yeah, yeah. cunning. Um, yeah, uh, no, I, I don't, I don't delve into water. Um, okay, that's all I mean, right. I shower, yeah, but yeah. mostly the spray. Yeah, you just use your spray on it. <laughs> yeah. Why did you become obsessed with your hair? Whoa, whoa. Oh, I'm uh, sorry. I, <laughs> it, you know what, it's me that's obsessed with your <laughs> yeah, hair. That's I mean, this what is, it is. This is. You know yeah. what, it's all the Twitter talk. Are you on the Twitter? I, uh, this the, you put the before everything. I do, that's and you know like, why? Because it's that's, very old. That's like a grand, yeah, yeah. A, it's a, a grandpa, grandpa thing. Thing. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Have you the, guys seen the... Right. Uh, and then you just... Right. The Spider-Man. Yeah, the Spider-Man. Right. Or the... Uh, uh, have you seen the Iron Man? Right. There He's not really Iron. Yes. Like that. Yes. Yeah. That kind of thing. Um, yeah, no, I, I'm on the, the Facebook. Right. Uh, <laughs> but, um, but apparently, you know, I get, I get a lot of requests because it's just me. I don't really wanna, I want to... I'm curious to get in touch with people from my past, so that's my real name. Are you big in the computers? Everybody's in the computers now. Nobody's not in the computers. I mean, Except I, Lauren Graham. Yeah. <laughs> right. Yeah, no, I prefer I prefer smoke signals. I think there's still some hope yeah. there. Um, I, 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 you know, I, I try to I try to print things, and that's and it, I, it never works. And well, so, printers don't work. That's okay, the only thing. So that's not a computer. No, 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 no. Printers okay. do not work. Okay. <laughs> All printers do because everybody when you talk to everybody, whenever I've tried to print anything, major problem. They don't yeah. work. No, 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 they don't. It's and I and it's always you know when you want because you're printing because you're rewarded. You've done you, something. Yeah, you're with finished. Your life. And you'd like to print. Uh, yeah. And give it to the officer. Yes. Right. Right. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> wow. What? Yeah. That's an interesting. Uh, yeah. you, we print what we what we have to, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. No. Um, no. Well, what do you do then for your spare time and leisure activity? Do you enjoy hang gliding or any kind of uh, airborne? You really think I'm athletic, don't you? I don't know. Actually, just having a go at it. It's, it's trying. You know, I was more athletic as a child. I was into karate. Uh, and karate, yeah. you say? Yeah. Oh, are you very? And there's advanced? a laugh, which is this is why I quit. Because no. People, uh, <laughs> Could you perform uh, some kind of hashi gishi right now? Um, no, I mentally. I, I took a lot of mental. Uh, mental karate. Mental karate. <laughs> Um, I mean, I really took physical karate, but what I've kept is mental karate. So more sort of conversational karate is what you're saying. Yeah, I mean, we're sparring. Um, right, right, and, I guess. Yeah, and I became, a, I became a black belt when I was 10, which is so wow. weird. Wow. Yeah, I know. And it, but it sucks because I was 10. And so, you know, I, in case you haven't noticed, I'm, I'm a slight man uh, <laughs> in, in height. Height. You dirty man. No, I didn't go there. You went there. I didn't go there. I was thinking... 
That's I why was you're talking about my feet so much. You're no, trying to... you know why? Because no, I, I was thinking about whoa, karate at yes. ten years old, a karate black belt. That's an amazing. I was thinking it, it was. It was amazing, except that I was like four feet tall, and I, everyone had to call me Mr. Helberg, and <laughs> it was like I had no sense of irony. So I would yeah. show up. And these like little Russian kids who were white belts would, you know, come up and be like, hey, Simon, Simon. And I'd be like, whoa, whoa, you know, it's Mr. Helberg. And they would be like, okay, Simon. <laughs> and then I would have to say, I'd have to say, all right, I'm going to tell the master on you, you know. Ah, that's that, what you do that, when that's you're. That's what wins the other kids over. <laughs> when you're a yeah. four foot. <laughs> A four-foot black belt, that's your secret weapon, <laughs> telling the master on, on the kids. So, yeah, and, and then I would try to punish them, and, and they would laugh, and I think everyone would laugh as soon as i turn around, uh, Mr. But Helberg. But you've, you've spun that into gold now. Yeah. You're, going to, you're in the big comedy show, you've got money? Yeah. You've got enough for spray? Enough, yeah. <laughs> Never enough for spray. Yeah, I know. We're, yeah. we're completely out of time, Simon. Thank you. But I wonder if I could ask you a favor. Uh-oh. Would you like to come back at some point? Yeah, what are you doing later? I mean... <laughs> uh, wait, 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 wait. No, I meant kind of on a date. Oh! <laughs> no cameras! No, no, uh, no, but please come back. I, I would love to come back. All right, well then, we'll do that then. Thank you. Uh, do you want to you wanna end up with an awkward pause? We sometimes do them. Yeah. All right. Just relax into it. Mr. Ferguson, is it? Craig, yes. Now, I understand that you're interested in applying for the position of our friend. That would be great. I I'm very lonely. <laughs> oh, no, oh, no, I, I don't see why we like, need a new... Relax, there can be two foreign ones. Oh, I didn't know that. Come on. So, Craig, what do you do for a living? Wait, excuse me, I have the clipboard. I'll ask the questions. So, Craig... What do you do for a living? I host the Late Late Show with Craig Ferguson. I see. And what time is that on? 12.37 a.m. Given that a.m. stands for anti-meridian, wouldn't it more logically be called the early early show with Craig Ferguson? I don't know. The answer is yes. Minus eight points. There was going to be a test. And you're really not going to like the physical. Now, please answer the following questions to the best of your ability. The first category is Star Wars. In the briefing, before the Death Star battle, Luke Skywalker is seated next to whom? Hang on, I think I know this. It's a trick question. You would think it would be Beggs, his childhood friend from Tatooine, but I'm going to go with Wedge. Correct. Five points. <laughs> I'm gonna go with Wedge. <laughs> that accent's more charming than mine. I don't like him. <laughs> Next question. For five points apiece, you have 20 seconds to name all the stretchy superheroes. Go. Uh, Plastic Man, Mr. Fantastic, uh, Elastigirl, uh, Stretch Armstrong. Yeah, Stretch Armstrong is a toy, not a superhero. Yeah, but they are making a Stretch Armstrong movie. And Slinky Dog was in Toy Story. I think you see the absurdity of your argument. Okay, time's up. I'm sorry, Mr. Ferguson. I think we're done here. Uh, no, no, you, you didn't ask me a single Doctor Who question. I really don't think that'll be necessary. Good day, Mr. Ferguson. <laughs> Doctor Who's home planet is Gallifrey. I said good day. <laughs> Doctor Who found the TARDIS in a scrap yard. Trust me, let it go. This is not a test you want to pass. Fine. I'll see you guys in a few minutes on the show. Does that mean to see us on the show? It was a humorous conceit predicated on a violation of the fourth wall, and I did not care for it. <laughs> we are well rid of him. Now what do we do? Cue the Late Late Show opening title montage. But I just told you I do not care for that. <laughs> 
In 2011, NASA launched the last space shuttle mission. As a publicity stunt, the crew included Academy Award-winning actor Michael Caine. But during a spacewalk, he got a little tipsy and floated away. Oh! Etc. Frozen for centuries in the dark reaches of space, he was finally defrosted in the year 2354. Uh, Captain's Log, star date, uh, March the 5th, 23, uh... <laughs> oh, yeah, what, what year is it supposed to be? 2354. 23.54. And this is a stapler. Your voice recorder's over there, Captain. <laughs> well... Thank you, first mate. It's strange, though, if you think about it, that this far into the future, we still need staplers. <laughs> All right. Not as strange as wearing a spacesuit in a battle cruiser that has full pressurization. <laughs> this is vintage. And if I hook up a vacuum at this little port down here near my business, ding dong, proper amount of suction, ooh la la splat. Here. Yeah. <laughs> and I'll tell you another thing, eyebrows. I got this. I got this at Cape Canaveral. Cape, is that a galaxy? Cape Canaveral? No, it's in Florida. In America. On Earth. Oh, yeah, I read about Earth. It's a, it's a small blue planet destroyed in a nuclear war started by President Justin Bieber. Yeah, yeah that's right. Now, I tell you, don't blame me. I wouldn't have voted for that furry little muppet. Captain, we're approaching Orion's belt. Oh, 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 Orion's belt, that means we're not far from Orion's arse. All right. Sometimes I wonder why they bother defrosting you. Oh, you bloody well know why they defrosted me. I am Michael Caine. I'm here to give some star power to this mission. <laughs> <laughs> the same star power you brought to Jaws 4. <laughs> Oh, 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 Miss Congeniality. <laughs> yeah, you, you really classed up that remake of Bewitch. <laughs> <laughs> no, actually, actually, Bewitch was pretty good, man. Oh. Yeah, it put a fresh twist on pretty some, some old concept. But Both of you, shut up! <laughs> Back on Earth, we had a saying, artists make films, the rest of you make television. <laughs> You're a smug bastard. Yeah, possibly, yeah. All right. <laughs> Where are my bloody star charts? Well, not to second guess you, Captain, but you should use the navigation unit. Whoop, whoop, beep, beep, beep. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> this is a navigation unit, then, is it? What a lovely hat. Reminds me of something. I can't think what. Hey, hello. 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 You all right? Beady beady. Beady beady. Beady beady, all right. I don't trust that thing. The zero gravity makes them farty. <laughs> yeah. Lieutenant, bring me my star charts, would you? All right, there you go. Hey, thanks, love. Oh. <laughs> so, you just violated the alliance code. The yeah, alliance code of conduct 1138 clearly states no captain shall fraternize with crew members of the opposite sex. Ah, that's where I've got you, see, because the lieutenant here is not of the opposite sex. All the blokes on this planet look like this. Really? What do the women on her planet look like? You don't want to know, really. Here, here. Wah, 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 wah. What's wrong? Hey, he's crying. Oh, <laughs> no. oh is that no? Is that That's an official, official alarm. Here, I can hear a yeah, cell yeah. phone going as well. Can you hear the cell phone going? Yeah. No, he has. He can throw his his voice. Oh yeah, right. That's him yeah. farting. Yeah. Oh, was that? Was that? Yeah. <laughs> Wait, oh, Captain, we, we must proceed slowly. These asteroids are displaying Brownian motions. I'll put a sock in it, will you? I'll do this. I've been driving spaceships since long before you two were grown in a test tube. Hey! 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 Hey!
a daisy. Oh, you say. Oh, oh, hello. Hello, love. Would you say I step out of this suit and uh, you could analyse my dark matter? <laughs> Tune in next week to find out. Is this the end of the captain's long run of incompetence and or sexual harassment? Probably not. Are these two going to wise up and realize that starring on a hit sitcom is a lot better than being on an obscure late night show? Oi. Oi. And is she really a dude? Really? Seriously? I gotta know. Well, uh, I'll, I'll try and find out then. All right, uh, where's my drink? Uh, carry on, everyone. <laughs> now, this, before we go, everybody, I, I'd like to thank the gentlemen of the cast of the uh, Big Bang Theory for being here. Thank you, gentlemen. Thank you. Thank you very much. Of the Big Bang Theory. And we would like to wish uh, a good night uh, to Kaylee, um, wherever you are out there. Wave goodbye to Kaylee. Everybody. Goodbye, Kaylee. Goodbye. <laughs> My first human guest this evening is uh, an actor <coughs> who stars in The Big Bang Theory on Thursday nights right here on CBS. <laughs> Please welcome Simon Helberg, everybody. Simon Helberg. to see you. Oh. It's very nice to see you and well done on Rooty Tooty Stinky Booty. Well, I, it's right I, in line with the show here. It's absolutely, you've come to the right place. <laughs> you couldn't be in more appropriate company. Yes. <laughs> How are you? You've, you've had a haircut. It's nice. I did. I went for the Ferguson. No, you didn't. The Fergie. No, it, it's, got a, it's got a touch of the Beebs, if you don't mind me saying so. The Beebs? A little bit. Well, he was, he was my old hairdo and, oh, then, yeah. and then I cut it and then he cut it. You, you cut your own hair because that's no, good, No, no, I didn't. Bieber cut my own hair. That was Jason, Jason Bieber. Jason, I nearly said his, yeah, his, Jason Bieber. His dimwitted, <laughs> Jason Bieber. His dimwitted brother, you know. No, Jason, I think Jason Bieber would be his brother who is in uh, SEAL Team 6 or something like oh, that. And he's like, like like Jason Bourne. Kill, killed Bin Laden. Maybe, maybe. maybe. That would be, what if be a Bieber like, killed Bin Laden? Wouldn't that really just, that would be a whole new gusto. That would be a surprise. Thing. Plus, he'd be a Canadian. <laughs> Beeps oh. is Canadian. Oh, look, I, you follow him more closely than I do. I do. <laughs> I, no judgment here. No, no, it's all right. What have you been up to then? Because you'll be on hiatus now, aren't you? Uh, I, I am on hiatus. Hiatus, by the way, is a Hollywood word for vacation. Yes. <laughs> yes, I was on hiatus, vacation, mm -hmm. for all the... Where are you going then? I was, I was uh, well, I was in Brazil. You've just been... Uh, and you, oh, yeah, I, got, I, I I know, I wrote that from Brazil. Did you really? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> Fala Portuguese? What? Yeah. <laughs> no, I learned, I, you know, I, I'm very slow. I learned the essentials. I learned uh, obrigado, thank obrigado, you. Obrigado, thank you, yeah. Uh, I learned escupa, sorry, and, and I learned boom boom, which is butt. Um, <laughs> and that, that got me through the whole trip, sadly. Um, what mainly boom What were you doing there? <laughs> It was, uh, you know, we had a lot. Of, we, our, the show's very popular, so we, we like, we had armed guards and bullets. Really, you were done with the, the cast of the show? Uh, right just a few of us went there. Really? Yeah. Did you uh, parade up and down in skimpy outfits for Carnival? Well, we missed Carnival. I did go to the beach, and I, I'm afraid to wear speedos. I'm, I'm a slight man. Embrace so. it, man. Embrace yeah. it. No, embrace it. You showed me backstage. No, I still, I'm just still not in. It's it, kind of like you go like that. Whoa. <laughs> Yeah yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. but it's not a good whoa. It's no, no, it's not. It's not a good whoa. I understand it's that. It's kind of like, oh, no. Yeah. yeah. It's, it's an unkempt, just pale disaster. Are we still talking about me, or...? <laughs> I'm segueing into me. Right, yeah. right. So you, you don't like to wear the speedos? So yeah, so I, I just, I found the shortest pair of, you know, swim trunks I could to try to, you know, I bought like a boy's medium swim trunks. But I didn't, I didn't want to commit fully to the, to, you know, the further it goes up. Yeah, uh, yeah. But there are a lot of thongs out there. Are and, guys wearing thongs? Um, I didn't look at the guys. I, I mean... I, <laughs> 
but you must in passing have no. I mean, you can't say, oh, I didn't even see any there guys. Were a few, there were a few male boom booms that really? I. Really? <laughs> guys, see, I think the idea of guys wearing thongs is hilarious. I, I, I know you showed me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's true. Uh, uh, no, no, please. Um, yeah, no, I, I, I tried to, to keep it civil and, uh, you know, I just showed a little leg to, to reward the, uh, the Brazilians with what they wanted. Is it. <laughs> Is it, uh, did you get any uh, hair work done there, if you know what I'm saying, Brazilian? Le oh, the wax? Yeah, yeah. I, I thought it was custom, so I, I did, I had the, I got the Bieber down there. Yeah. <laughs> you had it combed forward? <laughs> it falls like that. Hey. Yeah, that's... Some flat ironing and... Yeah, uh, no, it's nice. <laughs> no, but I mean, that's, that's where you're, that's where you were for work. Aren't you going to take a proper vacation? Like, go on vacation, vacation? Um, I, yeah, I'd like to, I mean, I, God, I don't know. Yeah, I'd like to maybe go, uh, go away somewhere. I've been traveling, I was in D.C. before that, so I'm what like... What were you doing I'm, in D.C.? I, I was there, uh, with the Creative Coalition for the Arts at the Correspondence Dinner, and it was exciting. I was sitting, like, near Dr. Oz and Sean Penn, like, that's the kind Whoa, of... Whoa, there's the power. And they were, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Comparing yeah. tattoos, or I, I don't know. It was. It was. Uh, do you have any tattoos yet? I'm concerned. No, for I, you. I. You are. You think you want. Yeah, yeah. Go, go. Do you, would you do one on the show if I were to get one? Because I'm. I, what are you saying, man? Of course I would. But you want to. You want to do this? I don't. I don't have that, that kind of threshold for for pain. Like whenever it's I. Not, would, it's not that painful, really. Honestly, it's not that bad. Except here. Except right where, where I, yours is. No, no, no. Up, up here's all right. But then when it gets to about here. Oh, ho, ho. Really? <laughs> yeah. The room went white. I saw the great spirit in buffalo form. <laughs> Like, Whoa, well, man. it's worth it because yeah. you have a snake tail. On yeah, no, it's, it's good. It goes all the way up and round down. It goes all the way, like a full life-size cobra. It's a light life-size. Well, it's. A, I saw a snake at the weekend. I just remembered. You did? Yeah, I forgot to tell everybody. I've just Thank told you. you now. Yeah, where, where I went for a walk in the Hollywood Hills. Oh, you can't do that. Well, it's dangerous I, out there. It was only a milk snake, but my a milk. What is they selling milk? Or yeah, it was mean? like. <laughs> My milk. No, it was, it was about this size, and okay. I nearly stood on it. I, I uh, nearly pooped my trousers. Well, they're they're probably used to that. You ever ever seen a snake in real life? Uh, I have. I they in in my like kindergarten class. I think we we had one in a in a you know a glass. That they, what? I know. Uh, That's dangerous. Well, I mean. That snake could have been hurt. These children all over it like that. I I grew up in the rough and. You know, rough and tough city of Los Angeles. There was no. Which edit. part of Los Angeles did the you The really rich part. The really rich part? <laughs> <laughs> did you really? <laughs> I did. Oh, it was, that's, that's lovely, look, though. It was a domesticated snake. Right. It came from a very wealthy background. Right. <laughs> It only ate, you know, it wore John a blazer. Dory. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it ate John Dory and sashimi, and that's uh, amazing. Uh, yeah, no, I, but I am scared. If I, you know, I probably would poop many people's trousers if I saw. It. <laughs> but that yet, you seem to surround yourself by things I'm afraid of. Is that to make yourself tougher, or to make yourself seem vulnerable, or? I don't know. It's a darkness within me. Yeah, <laughs> you're a brooder. I don't know what it is. I always embrace <laughs> that which terrifies me. Well, <laughs> It's like a scene from Virginia Woolf or something. Yeah. <laughs> You're very I'm intense. smelling my finger right now. Yeah. Yeah. Is that to make it look like you have a mustache? Yes. I'm, r I'm thinking this is where the mustache would be right. if, I, <laughs> if I was manly enough if to I grow one. If I dared to grow <laughs> one, this is where it I would I like be. to just do this sometimes, too. With, without a mustache? Yeah, no, no. It's just, just like that? Yeah. It also, it's like I'm twisting the end. I like it. That you like good. it? And well, you, I, you should grow a mustache. You could. I, you're, I on, you're on your vacation, hiatus. Yeah, that doesn't, I mean, that's a license to do certain things, but I still, I want to be presentable. I mean, are you saying America's mustachioed men and women are not presentable? <laughs> it's a little, it's a little ironic, you know. I feel like it's a lot of ironic. People are trying to sort of be ironic with. I their see what you mean. Hair. Yeah, that kind of seventies irony. Yeah, look, but I. Yeah. But th that being said, I did, I did do it one time. I'm, I mean, there's like, a, I feel like there's like a civil war reenactor sort of movement with a lot of hipsters. They dress like in coats and oh, yeah, monocles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And probably have like foot at Starbucks. They get the little hats. Yeah, on, yeah. Trying to look cool yeah, in Los yeah. Angeles. I'm like, it's ninety. Outside. Yeah, they get the little woolly yeah. hats on. Them. They're like trying to buy like the trench rot off of eBay yeah, to give themselves some trench rot. <laughs> I pulled that out. Right? Yeah, that's good. The, you know, a civil war disease. Yeah, I'm was it stopped. really a civil war disease? I think trench rot was something. Uh, it sounds bad, right? It's it's a staple of late night comedy. I know that. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's up there with Rudy Tootie stinking. And we come full circle. And yeah. we're out of time. 
What? I, 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 I know it goes so fast. I know. I, you just told me about snakes and. and yeah, 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 we could, you know. Yeah, yeah awkward pause or uh, mouth organ? What was the second? Mouth organ? Mm. That sounds really dirty, too. I don't know. <laughs> oh, it's just me. Oh. <laughs> It's a, it's a, it's one of, uh, it's a, a term for a harmonica. Or a harp, call, some people say. Uh, some, no, no, a harp is a different thing. That's a giant instrument with strings I on it. I know that, yeah. but the bluesy people say, you know, you got your harp. Oh, really? Like, yeah. Oh, well. Uh, Mouth organ is in a whole other part of town, they say. <laughs> <laughs> That's a club I went to in Brazil, and uh, <laughs> it was a lot of you fun. You wear your little Speedos there, didn't <laughs> yeah. you? Yeah. yeah. Against my will. So, uh, uh, mouth organ, harmonica, uh, Now harp? I want to see the mouth organ. I, I mean, let's... Uh, let's All right, let's well, would you like to perform on oh. the mouth organ? Sure. <laughs> has it been sterilized, or is this... Yes. Oh, I get my own. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, mean, I think you're clean, I just... No, no, know. no, I, I'm... Re <laughs> I'm reasonably clean. Like, when Howie Mandel comes on the show, he's like, it's okay. So Really? Yeah, well, yeah. he does. It's just all yeah, he's, he's a germaphobe. You a germaphobe? Uh, you know, I, I, I wasn't going to play your mouth organ, but <laughs> I take this off, right? Yeah, you can take that off. Yeah. Okay, see, I'm Yeah, learning. then you can get to the germs. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Ooh, I think that's backwards. Ooh, that was good, though. A lot of people do that, you know, when they come on here <laughs> they, and they pretend oh. they can blow it. Can't you put it in, like, post or something? That I, post? <laughs> <laughs> You're funny! I, you know, uh, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. It's, lo it's lovely to see you. Thanks for doing a chest bump. I didn't want to get my germs on you. I've got no. some kind of a cold, I, I, a terrible uh, illness. It's a little more intimate, a chest bump, I think, almost than any other. Well, only if you do a slow chest bump. Or if you're topless. <laughs> I've never thought of doing this show topless, but maybe I should. I'm just pitching it. I, it's, well, it's, it's not a bad idea. I tell you what, you take off your top, we'll see how that looks, and then... Well, uh, I don't think... <laughs> you probably have Vicks Vapor Rub on your chest. Uh, now. I, Maybe I do. <laughs> well, in that case. No, no, no. I, uh, no how, well, yeah, I got sick because I, I have a child. You're about to have a child. I am. Uh, so your child made you... you yeah, yeah. You, they start going to the... He's going to the little kind of bendy and stretchy class with his mom. You know, my littlest one. The old one goes to the... Bendy and stretchy? Yeah, you know, kid, you know kids yoga or something. I don't know. Okay, wow. I didn't know it started. It starts that early. They, yeah, it, like a year old. Yeah, they have to go... They have to meet other kids. You can't just keep them in a the house, you know. I, I, yeah, yoga is a way, I guess. But it's not yoga. guys. You know, fit for kids. Or something. Okay. Yeah, yeah. No. What? what not... you, you got a problem with? No, kids doing I just. Yoga? I, it's one of my pet peeves. You what know. yoga? I, I I heckle kids doing yoga. You do? I do. <laughs> <laughs> I just. <laughs> Don't worry. I fried a cat once. <laughs> I heard it's about a it. joke. It's a joke. I'm just kidding. I know I shouldn't even joke about that. I know, but I can't help it because I know it annoys you. So uh, I, I, ha I love cats. I have. I love cats. cats too. You I have three, really? Yeah. And yeah. you're going to have a baby in your house with three cats? Well, they, and they're start. I think they're starting to turn on us too. Oh, I think yeah, they, you wait till the baby. Yeah, they, yeah, yeah. They know. They know that the the baby is coming. And and cats like, know a lot. Yeah, they do. I know. And I stare at them, trying to sort of read their minds at, at times, which is usually I'm un unsuccessful at it. But but they're starting to. Take a lot of pot. <laughs> You don't need to when you got cats, man. No, I know. <laughs> cats are kind of like Paul in fur form. Yeah, 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 they really are. I had to be careful when I said fur there. Yes. Did you notice that? I did. You, you were. I, I slowed down and went fur. You're on a lot of drugs right now. I am. <laughs> Hey, uh, do you watch the Downton Abbey? I haven't. I haven't seen it. I'm like the only. I, I'm the only one. Apparently, I, I got the gist. I liked the scene. I saw. Oh, I tell you, when the two uh, flaming skulls made out. Uh, yeah. 
That's yeah. awesome. That was the other, the working title for it. The two what, flaming, flaming Skulls make yeah. out? Yeah. But it's a little more dignified, I think. Yeah. Down so when's your baby come? Pretty soon, right? Uh, I, yeah. Hopefully, yeah. yeah, yeah in a yeah. couple months. Your life will change. Life will that's, change. That's what I hear. I don't know. I'm, I, I expect things will be... It's weird. I'm normally used to... I was saying to my wife, like, when, when something big's going to happen, yeah. you normally... It happens and then it finishes and oh, then you no, move no, on. No. Yeah. This yeah. this doesn't. Oh, finish. you want it to finish, but it ain't going. To. But it, it happens in two months and then that and then it just keeps. And you're a dad forever. and you'll always be a dad. I I that's yeah yeah. That's and what happens is right now you are at the pinnacle of your coolness. Okay. You have. Thank you're, you. You're, I, you're, no, you are. You're, I've been like, told. I, you're young. You have all your hair. Okay. You're on a hit show. And right now, just when the baby's born, that's when you start. <laughs> that's the decline. As soon as you hit dad, it's like, yeah. ooh, da, da. And as the child grows, you go lower and lower and lower. Until when the child's run about puberty, you're just a jerk! Gosh. Well, we better get her started in yoga immediately. Yeah, that's where we go. Maybe I'll. You ever do done it. yoga? You ever do? Yoga? I have done yoga. Yeah, uh, yeah, I, 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 I enjoyed it. It's very slow. I, I mean, I'm not. Oh, a, you did slow yoga. What? You, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the fast, the speed yoga classes were oh, all. No, you want to try up. the quick yoga? In and out five minutes. That's what. Yeah. yeah. I tried working out because I, you know, I'm going to be a dad. And I want to be responsible, and I tried, but I hadn't worked out in probably ten years, and I tried to do it all in a day. <laughs> And I, I tore something in my knee because I was, I ran up, I was doing the stairs, like... Oh, those stairs? You don't like, want to do that. That's and hard. And I did it. Yeah, it's very hard. And Go especially... a nice when, walk. Well, Have I... Have a sandwich. I... <laughs> Yeah, I, I enjoy sandwiches. I just uh, I love a sandwich. But you don't really, unless they're heavy. Well, let's talk about sandwiches. Okay. What can you like on a sandwich? This is good. Uh, I like, gosh, I like lots. I like a tuna salad sandwich. I like turkey. Uh, I, the you, same I sandwich? It, I didn't hit you with the t tuna. Well, I'm trying to, sure, I, I'll mix it all. Monster. I don't, I don't know. I See, the thing is about tuna, if it's the white tuna, I like it. But I always have to be careful because it's got to be dolphin-friendly tuna. And then you think, well, does dolphin-friendly... You think tuna be... hates dolphins? No, the thing is, sometimes, sometimes the dolphins swim with the tuna and they get caught in the nets yes, and that's, I know. that's terrible. So, you know, you have to get the dolphin We're friendly. We're just talking about sandwiches. Now you're making me into a horrible person. <laughs> hey, you're the one that kills dolphins. <laughs> <laughs> Only if they're mean to... <laughs> mm. No, no, you're right. I can't come out of that. No, no, so I'm sweet. kidding. Dolphins are great. And Actually, they taste good, honestly. Yeah, they're delicious. Okay. Yeah, no, they're not. I've never... Have you ever tasted... Dolphin? The flesh of a dolphin. <laughs> Uh, I've I've gotten into a little tussle with one in the sea once, and I bit, I bit the. You bit a dolphin. I bit a dolphin, and I got a sense of what it would be like to finish <laughs> biting and eating that. It was good. Yeah. Um, oh man, I, either you are really weird, or my drugs are really kicking <laughs> in. Right? Hey, we have to. Uh, you have to take a break. Any uh, particular product that CBS advertises you like to pitch in and help with? Uh, do they do they sponsor? Is tuna on the on the list? I don't know. Let's take a look. We'll be right back. To be you have to. No, absolutely. Yeah, welcome back, everybody. Oh, no. I'm just, uh, <laughs> just talking to my buddy here. Yeah. <laughs> How long have you been here? Little dolphin killer. <laughs> oh, no, it was a joke. It was a joke. It was a joke. It's my prison name, actually. Don't. <laughs> You ever been in jail for anything? Uh, no, I I haven't ever really done anything wrong. <laughs> in that in that sense, I mean, I uh, no. Why have you been to jail? Come on, man. Look at me. Yeah. <laughs> You're a sweetheart. I, I don't know. You got a snake cup and tattoos. That's like... That's... I've been to jail. All right. Yeah. Uh, yeah. You'd do well. <laughs> uh, I saw the quotation marks around I didn't that. do any quotes. I said you'd do well. Oh. I'd, I'd take care of you. Yeah. It'd be like a little puppet for people to Kinda. just sit on the lap. That's, I guess that's... Uh, 
That's what they would say. No, to sit no, on their lap. no. I, I, the only time I went to jail was for being drunk, you know, and then they, they let me go in the floor. I was just the drunk tank. It was never anything. Like, I didn't do hard time. Okay. No. Yeah, I, uh, that's, that's something that's commendable, I guess. <laughs> I don't know if it's commendable, but it's just one of those things, you know, and well, now I'm stuck here in a sort of a prison. <laughs> Hey, uh, we're out of time. Oh, oh. Uh, should we plug in? Oh, Big Bang Theory, that's good, isn't it? Sure, we'll plug that. Yeah, I, I like it. All right, anyway, uh, we're out of time, so... Uh, what do you, uh, what do you fancy? Uh, awkward pause, mouth organ, or the big cash prize? You want a big cash prize? I'll do, I don't, uh, yeah, I, I would love the big cash prize. Oh, you do? Well, this, this is risky, because we haven't rehearsed it. I, I heard. <laughs> I think they're going to catch on. Though, All right, we'll try. What time is the Shadow Stevens? Time for the big cash Uh, there are two ways to win. You can either, um, <clears throat> you know, answer the question, or you can guess what's in my box. Here's how that works. I imagine a box or something in it. I don't know what's in it. Only Jeff Peterson knows what's in it. You guess what it is. He'll tell you. If you're right, you win the prize, uh, which is uh, $50 and quarters in a bag with a dollar sign on it. Wow. Or, <laughs> or you don't. Okay. Uh, well, let's go, right? Do yeah. I have to tell you something now? Do I tell you what I want? Do you want the box or the question? Oh, I want the question. I oh, the, the question. question. Right. Okay. Sorry. Sorry Jeff. That was so many rules, and then you threw money in my face, I got... Okay. I know. All right. And, and jail's worse, yeah. let me tell you. <laughs> All right, you ready? Yes. Iceland is in the North Atlantic. Its capital city is Reykjavik. Hmm. Your character on the Big Bang Theory is a scientist at Caltech. Mm -hmm. In what city is Caltech located? Pasadena. That's, that's pretty easy, that, wasn't it? <laughs> How long have you been doing that show? <laughs> Five years. I mean, that oh, would be terrible on, if I didn't know that. What the hell? Are you guys running some kind of Ponzi scheme here? <laughs> like, you set him up, he takes away the 50. Look, just, just take the money. Oh, oh. That's quarters. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Terrific actor. He stars in The Big Bang Theory, which is on Thursday night at 8 on CBS. <sighs> Take a look at that. Simon Helberg, everybody. Simon Helberg. Man, I love your shoes. Do you like them because they're six inches off the ground? No, or because... I... <laughs> I'll get you. Hang on a second. I'll get you something. We've got to end You got a step stool? Here we are. Ah. This is embarrassing. Ah, there you go. Here Thank we... you. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. We, 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 this, uh. the, we, we keep it in case Tom Cruise is ever on the show. Well, <laughs> it's a bed for him, I think, actually. It is. He could store his little nuts <laughs> in there. He'd be lovely. <laughs> How are you? You look great. Well, thank you. you, you I love your hair. It's, Thanks. It's, it's gone very luxurious. It has gone luxurious. It's fantastic it's, it, with, with age, I, we, I'm going luxurious. What age are you, like 25? No, uh, you know. <laughs> I've always wanted to do that when I... Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. Yeah. Make you feel old. Yeah. <laughs> I'm actually from a 20 Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I, I just, I also have a compulsion to wipe my mouth. If I'm really? <laughs> No. Hey, hey, wait, your tie's popping. I know, it looks yeah, like yeah. I have, uh, my spine is in the front. It's, 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 yeah, that's what it looks like. <laughs> okay. Yeah, no, you're all right? You comfortable there? Can I help you? No, I mean, it, that's like a useless, it'd be a useless it's superpower. It's definitely a problem. We're going to have to do something. Well, I mean, well, I, you Take know. the tie and then pull it out the bottom. I'm tucking it in. Oh, yeah, and then I can pull it out of my... Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I, I, I gotta say, 
It kind of draws the eye, though. Yeah. That's the problem. <laughs> that's the problem. That's, yeah, that's, that's the solution. Here, uh, uh, we'll stick this over it, will you? Okay. <laughs> By the end, you're not going to see. I have a stool and a, a napkin. I just, yeah, yeah. No, you'll, I'm very you'll, high maintenance. You're ready for a shave. <laughs> yeah. yeah, exactly. No, that's fine. Okay, this um, is much. All right. Much yeah, less. no, everything's great. So, yes. how are things now with you? <laughs> now it's. Now things there, are great. There's a draft now. Oh, but you other must. Than that, you, you must be used to this. You've got a little baby. I you? do. Yeah, this is like a burpee cloth. Right, exactly. Is, I know about babies. I've had two. Well, I haven't had them, but yes, no, I, no. I know. I don't. I don't feel proper taking credit for doing much, but I, I mean, oh, well, now I do. Yeah. But the, the whole birth. Everyone applauds when you say you have a ba you have a baby. But for a guy, it's. I don't. I don't think they did. Really, I just. <laughs> I just hear it in my head. Oh, no, no. I don't want to like, oh, you're right, okay, you got a baby. <laughs> We've all got babies, <laughs> Pity baby applause is the worst. Yeah, it is. How is your baby? She's great. She yeah. is, uh, she's eight months. That's uh, great. That's the yeah. best time. Yeah, so she's got her first tooth. It's not really. <laughs> yeah. It is a good time. It's you know okay, what? but... What's no, i got to be honest with you. I think the first 18 months, holy crap. It's hard. Uh, I, I, I wish they could arrive, like, you know, around about two, two and a half. Yeah. yeah you know, it'd, like, be, it'd be painful for the woman, but... Uh, <laughs> I think I think they were designed to come out small and. Yeah, well, why don't they make women bigger? Then? I, you know, they do in different parts of the country. And right. The world, but um, no, I, I, uh, yeah, I, I like the first eight months. I like every day is so. She's got a little. Wait, wait, now. She, it's, your, it's your first, isn't it? Yeah. Does yeah. it change after that? <laughs> no, every day is a holiday. <laughs> She got a little tooth though. She that's does. nice. That's great. That's like a, a huge. You know, it is. It's a it's a big moment. It's and lovely. I didn't. I discovered it because I. She goes. She always goes to bite my nose because I think it's a. It's a. There's a lot of real estate there for her to <laughs> invest in. And uh, and she and I felt something, a, a shooting pain. And uh, and that's how I discovered. That's how. I, but otherwise, she hasn't really been the, like waking. Not up crying or anything. Not not that much. I mean, it's. I, you know, I've heard I've heard a theory, and I don't know if this is true because I only have boys. But she's on drugs. Is what no, 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 no. <laughs> I I really. No, no. I was uh, <coughs> no, I've heard a theory that girls, when they're infants, are easier to deal with with are, than boys. It's when they get older. That, as right. No. Yes. The trouble. Oh well, yeah. Uh, that I I can. Speak to yeah. You have what? What are two boys? Two boys. Oh, yeah, so you're yeah. never gonna have to deal with the nope. the angry teenage girl. Oh, I am. Just but, not. But, but no. <laughs> hey, come yeah. on now. But only on Twitter. <laughs> so. <laughs> yeah. So it's all right. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, you get a lot of that, I suppose. Don't uh, you the Tweety? Yeah, there's a lot of yeah, there's a lot of a lot of the Tweety uh, yeah, thing yeah. going on. Yeah, I, you're active on the Tweety. I am. Yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm there. Um, yeah, I definitely. There's a lot of a, a lot of people that don't speak English that that follow me, which is great. I don't know if I appeal to. So I get a lot of things that don't quite. Really? Make, what kind of languages are we talking? I mean, well, there's other languages, but then there's things. I hope that it's I, that they don't speak English as their first language, or they're just very mentally set back. <laughs> Might be that. Which is, you know, yeah. again, I appeal to. I, this is. This no, no, no. That I think. Well, you and me both then, because I there's. Uh, I seem to get. I'm. I'm going cold on Twitter. Yeah. Honest. Yeah. I'm getting a little bit. It's a little <laughs> depressing. Uh, I. I mean, I get. A, I get a lot of love, but I get a fair amount of. of Negativity. Mm. Uh, that well, that's the ones I send you. There's a lot of that. No, I, that's yeah. what I. And I'm, I'm, I'm here to ask you to just please go easy on. Yeah, yeah. No, I, I, well, I'm sorry. I didn't realize your kid was so young. <laughs> Otherwise, I wouldn't have been so tough. Yeah. Well. Yeah. But that's good. You're going to have more. Have you discussed um, it yet? I, I, yeah. I think. I think. With your wife, though. Have you discussed it with that's, your wife? No, I, I, I'm, I'm shopping around, but. Um, <laughs> <laughs> My wife is not going to see this. No, no, she, we can cut that out. Okay. <laughs> I'm not um, going to cut it out. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm I'm an open book. Um, yeah, so no, we'll, we'll have. I think we'll, we'll have more. I'm scared though because I also hear that you know I have like thousands of pictures of my daughter on my my phone. It's always full, and I hear that once you go into the second, you don't take any no, pictures. No, that's that's not true at all. You you take yeah, still? I've got I've, I've got well documented. I, if I wanted to make a full length feature documentary about yeah. either kid, I have the material right. Now. Yeah, it's uh, well. You know, it's fine. Are you I trying mean, to I pitch me an idea about your daughter? Yeah, yeah. It's a documentary about a two year old kid. All He's right. got a little car it goes burp, burp. yeah yeah, yeah. It's, it's actually that's awesome i think like after about two run about two and then on from there it's fantastic she does right now she also does the she she doesn't quite cross she does like the inchworm sort of like that 80s uh like break dancing move or do you think oh yeah 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 that's a very good sign yeah. that's a sign of high intelligence of break dancing break sure, dancing? why not yeah, yeah. I mean, we, we put her on the boardwalk and you know put a piece of cardboard under her and <laughs> 
Open up, yeah. open up the guitar case. Nice. Yeah. No, but I just worry because they say some babies skip, uh, skip crawling and then go right to walking, and then I. Yeah, yeah, my uh, my second boy Liam did that. So then, when do they learn to crawl? Then do you? He never learns to crawl. So he, he's baffled. Is by he going to be a grown man and not? Yeah. Know how if, to crawl? if he if he ever goes into the military and they say, right, crawl over yeah, there, he's like, I can't, yeah. I can't do it. I, I skipped. Yeah, yeah. I, I'll just have to walk. Because it's there. awkward to go back and learn how to crawl when you're yeah, like once seventeen. You, yeah, once you miss that window of opportunity, you're done. Well. <laughs> He should not join the military. I, I think that's... Well, come on now. All right. Yeah. I don't want to go. So, yes, let's get your son. He's not here. <laughs> All right. It's a touchy subject. <coughs> Sorry. <laughs> Ooh, nice color on your cup there. Thank you. We the have guy, to take uh, a break. We'll be right back <laughs> with Simon Albert. <laughs> Uh, Simon Helberg, he was having some troubles with his tie, so he stuck out his pants and everything uh, seems to work out. Put the little thing. It, there's actually glitter on this, though, which... Yeah, yeah. Kathy Griffin was here last night. Oh, there you yeah. go. <laughs> there's glitter everywhere. Really? She just... It just She's oozes. just so show business. Have you met Kathy? I have met. I met her right on the way up here, too, as well. She was still here. She's... <laughs> she doesn't go home. <laughs> They were trying to force her the out the window. I don't you, know. Man. <clears throat> hey, I, you see when I see you that little white thing on your lap there, have you ever been a baker or a Freemason? Uh, I, well, I worked at Ben and Jerry's when I was like, uh, which yeah. doesn't really, I guess it's sort of between. It's really that neither. is, that, that's, that's what they say. That's the hybrid between baker and Freemason. <laughs> yeah, right. that's what I, I, they put an ad out. I saw yeah, yeah. that. I said, I'll, I'd like. Are you uh, concerned about <laughs> Freemasonry and baking? Yeah. Scoop, scoop. scoop some ice cream. Exactly. Sort it out. Yeah. That's how I got hooked up. So, yeah. Is that your first job? It, it was. And they, they were very, they were very paranoid about the, the art of scooping, actually. It was like they, they would show you the proper way because they said you could injure your wrist, you could get tendonitis. And I, then they brought out my manager and he had like a well, you're the manager? Up. Yeah. You, well, your manager said, I got you a great gig. You're going to work in Ben & Jerry's. <laughs> not, not that kind of manager. Yeah. Oh, a manager yeah, in yeah. Ben & Jerry's. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a lot of famous people that come in. Yeah, that's right. They ask I got you a great gig. Yeah. Good news, bad news. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Good news, you're going to Hollywood. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> bad news, you're surrounded by Chunky Monkey. Yeah. Um, and I'm not talking Is about that. Is that bad news? Uh, <laughs> that's true. Uh, so yeah, I had to do that. But then the, the the manager of the place came in. He had a, like a, a wrist brace on. I guess he scooped wrong. It was like a before and after. Man, that's it's like a warning. Yeah, he yeah, scooped yeah. incorrectly, and he was like injured for life by by. <laughs> But I used to just eat. I used to just eat the ice cream. I love ice cream, me. It is, and I invented little like I would make my own choco taco things. You know what those are? They're like. I don't. Oh well, uh. you know, you make a you make like a cone. Uh, a cone the, the, it comes, you know, you do it in a flat sort of thing, and then you bend it into a taco shape, and you fill it with ice cream, and you just you just cry in a corner alone. This sounds awesome. Awesome. Yeah, that's. I would like one of those. I can, I can, I can hook you up. I, I have right. connections. We're out of time. Oh, well, uh, all right. Awkward pause. Uh, yeah, sure. Quiet moment. Oh, is there a difference? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, quiet moments kind of friendly, and there's music. Awkward pause. No, nothing. Oh, it's a quiet moment. I you guess know, we, you've lost we have your no choice. choice. Yeah. It's a quiet moment. Just. Simon, uh, you, you look nice. Thank you. You got, your, you got your sweater on. I got it. Uh, yeah, you're cold. 
No, uh, no I, I, sh I, I, this is why, why I'm wearing a sweater. Oh, well, it's, it's nice. You look, you look great, and you get your, your shoes and well, stuff. You, is that abnormal to your guests? No, like, no, a lot of people have shoes. Have you, when's the last time you shaved? Well, uh, this morning, actually. Can you tell me? <laughs> You're a very hairy man. Are you very hairy all over? Like, very, like, from just it's, like that? It's, <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Uh, I have, I do have some hair in some uh, unusual uh, places, which is, uh, and I, I have, I have like a reverse uh, happy trail. You know, they call a sad trail. Well, you have a some kind of spinal hair. I, yes, I, I, I had, you know, because the happy trail is there because supposedly it leads to a, a happy place, depending on. It depends on your point of view, there, I guess. It, it does. I'm. Being optimistic, but I, I, yeah, I was in college and I, I was, uh, I was in a class where we, I we took my shirt off. I was in acting school, so we mm. change sometimes in front of people and someone take your clothes off in front of people. Is yes, what I'm saying. yeah, I got kicked and out. Acting but, school. <laughs> well, and someone, a, a, a girl, came up and said, "I didn't know you had a, a tattoo." And I said, "What?" She said, "On your back, you turn right." Oh, oh, sorry, never mind. And then she laughed and I said. <laughs> What you know, and I, I had I had felt some fuzz, but it, the day fuzz becomes hair is the day you, you become a man. Yeah. Become a man. Yeah. yeah. I think that's in the Bible somewhere. Well, I, uh, uh, <laughs> might might be. <laughs> the day fuzz becomes hair. So yeah, yeah, I turned I, around and I did my best to. You ever had it waxed? Um, my oh god. No, well, I a lot of guys have told me to do that. Uh, like, guys, that, this is going... Whoa, dark. yeah. Some people on my show have seen this, uh, uh -huh. some of the actors, and they're like, dude, you gotta, you gotta take Do care a... of that. I didn't know that it was such a, a, a problem. Um, Man, have you, have you ever uh, been to Dover? <laughs> <laughs> you, that's when you can see it really clearly. Yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh, so... <laughs> I don't think you should have it waxed. I think it's part of your deal now. Anyway, you've got kids now. You know, kids like an unusual hairy Yeah, father. they can hang. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's kind of... My, where, is it, where is your daughter now? She, uh, she is 16 months. Uh, yeah, that's uh, like a year and four months. Uh, uh, yeah. If you want to get technical. Well, yeah, I just, you know, I, that's, I use the old-fashioned system. Well, I don't, why, how long do you count months? months? I don't know. I think till 24, maybe. 24 years old? 24 or? years old, yeah. Okay. yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, Until, I, yeah, I don't know what the month thing is about. I would say after a year, the probably you know, a year. Okay, because I should probably stop saying I'm 387. Yeah, it's it's too much. Huh? With the amount of hair you've got, people can guess. They can, yeah, yeah. It's it's, it's so. A, uh, what does she do? She walk. She'll be walking by now, then, right? She she <clears> is. She's <throat> walking. Uh, yeah, she's 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 making demands. She's she makes demands. A lot of she wants to see. As soon as she wakes up, she wants to see uh, cars in the morning. So she has to be taken outside to. What well, actual cars or the. Uh, movie cars. No, uh, movie cars? Yeah, yeah, you know, that movie cars where the cars talk. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Oh, you'll freak out when you see this, man. This is a great movie. <laughs> wow. Yeah, the cars talk, and then the other cars come over, and they're like, hey, and then Mater's there, like, two Mater. It's great. Wow. Yeah. They can do anything in Yeah, movies. yeah, it's great. No, she wants the real, she wants the real deal. So she wants to look to, at real cars? Yeah, but only if they're driving, and that's awkward. You know, I have a ba I don't want to put her, moving cars are considered dangerous. Yeah, absolutely. For, <laughs> for the year and four month old, that's right. about, yeah. You Not till two that you can let no, Oh, you're not even then. Mingle you know. on the freeway. So yeah, I, I've I've tried to be a responsible dad and hold her when the cars go by. So that's, that's kind of adorable, though, that she wants to see cars. Yeah. You get, you, does she sleep all right? You get any sleep? Oh yeah, she's she's a she's a champ. She sleeps like from 6:30 p.m. to 6:30 a.m. Oh man, just, I hate you so much right now. now. <laughs> Whiskey does does wonders. Ah uh, yeah. Um, Do you yeah. ever take uh, crystal meth? <laughs> I mean, I, I've, I've dabbled, I, I, the meth mouth thing, I, it's why, you know, if you start early enough, you can get braces and reconstructive. No, 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 I never, I never did it. You didn't, I, I'm too vain, I think. Yeah, I, don't, I wouldn't, I can't be. Because the mouth, that. the mouth falls apart, right? Well, that's not my main reason for not doing it. What's the other, everything else sounds great about it. Really? I don't know. <laughs> Just I don't need anything. To, I I like to be able to relax. You know, that, it, Beth is it's a it's oh it uh, gets you zippy. Run well, take tonight's studio audience for example. <laughs> and that's that. Uh, the, the Big Bang Theory this season. So you get married this season then? Uh, I, well, I was married uh, I was married last season. That's what I meant. Uh, it's yeah. okay. Uh, 
Uh, yeah, so I'm still married. You're and, still married uh, to... No, but in real life you're still married. I, well, all, all of the above. So yes. you're married in real life and you're fictionally married? Yeah, so I can't even go to work and, and, and be a bachelor. And pretend to not be married. No, I... Also, it's a bad idea to pretend not to right, be married Right, I think that's... That, you never hear that advice Ooh. at your wedding. Just wait till you have that moment to pretend you're not married. It's going to be... It's all, it's all right to pretend you're not married with your wife. Sure. Right. Then, then if you're both pretending in the same room you're not married, then it can be like, whoa, oh, oh, yes. yeah. Yes. Uh, but, uh, it was a party then, I think. Well, sort of, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Where's your wife from? She is from uh, Los Angeles as well. I'm from L.A. So. Mm, I knew that. All right, you don't need to yell. Well, I just I knew, I knew. Okay, I was checking. Okay, well, yeah. So we are both we are both products of, of L.A. Well, that's uh, good though. Where did you meet? Uh, we went to the same high school, but we met after. We went we went to. Uh, this is no. adorable. It is. Uh, <laughs> I went to a, a housewarming party at her house. I didn't know her. I knew her brother, and uh, and then we we ended up. Someone turned out the lights and put on Thriller, and I danced. What kind of mad party is this? <laughs> it's you know it's 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 a party it's a party for people that can't dance. Uh, you turn off the lights, and then you're you're a wonderful wonderful dancer. That's what I've learned. Is I've never been to one of these Hollywood orgies before. Well, <laughs> I guess that does really sound like a, a no. It does. A it it sounds rather innocent and fun. It it it, it was, and we we danced to a Thriller, and I, I thought I, I just I just try to be as moronic and, and and buffoonish as I can. That was my tactic to hit on girls, which is why I only had one real girlfriend, and then I married her. Because I think that's a, I think that's absolutely uh, the way to go, though. It, it was good. I just show all my my flaws and dance like a, a maniac, and then we ended up uh, months later uh, talking. I had to work hard. I had to work kind of really. Did you have to work? For a bit? I did. I did. I had to. I had to just convince her that that I was. Uh, what, what were your tactics? I mean, what did you do? What, was there any outside her bedroom window with a boombox or anything like that? Well, I waxed my back first. Well, okay. Um, and uh, <laughs> they wanted that. <laughs> yeah. They love meth and they hate back. <laughs> yeah, they love meth and hate back hair. That's apparently. <laughs> Those are two good, two good qualities. Um, yeah, no, I, I, you know, I just, I kept showing up places. Did you, or, or, well, you know. you, like, like stalking her? Did is, you stalk? is that the word for it? Yeah, yeah, it's actually word. illegal. Yes, uh. okay, so, yeah, we, we met in an orgy party and then I stalked her, I guess, is the unromantic way. Of, well, it's, it sounds very wholesome to me, though. Okay, well, it's an L, you know, we're from L.A., that's, 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 that's nice. Yeah, so, no, it worked, it worked, and uh, I, I just kept inviting her to shows. I was doing comedy shows, and I don't know, I guess she, it took her a while to, to find me. Appealing, and I stopped doing comedy after that, uh, performing live because it was it was a lot of stand-up comedy. I was doing sketch comedy, uh, and again, it was it was me in horrible you wanna, you outfits. Want, you want to stay away from that? You do. It's yeah, uh, like women don't enjoy a sketch comedian. They don't because it's really about how just awful you can make yourself look. I think I wore overall I wore overall shorts in the sketch. That that actually sounds kind of hot. It, well. <laughs> Hey, Tom Lennon wore those little shorty shorts in Reno 911, and he's happily married for many years now. Right, okay. Well, I don't he, know where I'm going with he's that, my, but he's, yeah, yeah. he's who we all look up to, I think. In the leg department, you betcha, he's got some gams on he, him, that fella. He does. Well, yeah. this, is, this, is, this is a confession. Do you do now. squats? Uh, I can. Do you want me to now? No, no, I was just, just in checking. general? Yeah. I, I, hey, I, are you in therapy? Uh, <laughs> I would like to be. All right, let's let's cure the hell out of me right now, please. I don't think cure is a kind of is a, a judgmental word. It implies there's something wrong with you. I don't think there's anything wrong with you. You think I'm okay? Yeah, I think you're. I think you're a little tough on yourself because of your freakishly hairy back. Uh, it's true. My my mother had a hairy back as well. Did she really? I just I just didn't want to face you know my roots. I guess was nothing wrong no with being hairy. Intended. Nothing wrong with being hairy. You think that. That being a hairy man from only behind is not something that I need to get down on my. Well, it's part. It, it's part of evolution. I mean, the, you know, when when you're only hairy at the back, you know, in the olden days out there during the caveman times, they would people would see you and think you were a tree. Right. <laughs> so the the front has evolved, and the yeah, back the front, is, the front the, is civilized man, and the, the back, back is monkey. You, yeah. It's true. I, that is definitely a glass half full. Glass half full, glass half empty. Uh, a man Front half hairy. Front side <laughs> back side hairy. It's a man half hairy way of yeah. looking at things. Um, mm. Well, we have to go to a commercial break because I think sponsors are going to be delighted with this evening. I think. <laughs> we're right back, everybody. <laughs> I'm 
to, I've just been talking to Simon about what happened with uh, his girlfriend, who's now his <laughs> wife, about what happened when you were courting her. You chased her to Paris? I did, I did. This is more and more just painting me as a stalker. No, well, I it's, <laughs> I, it's entertaining the hell out of me. So you, <laughs> you, uh, she went to Paris to escape you? Uh, you could look at it that way. As, okay, let's As do a that. clinical psychologist, I right. hope you'd have my back more than, no. Too hairy, my, yeah. <laughs> So she went to she went to Paris to sort of forget about her doomed romance with you, right? Yeah, I, I think to flee me is definitely a fair right. way of looking. And then you followed her there? I did. I followed her. Uh, I followed her because I, I I had made a mistake. I broke up with her, and I realized that that it was it was a horrible mistake uh, immediately after breaking up with her. And right. I, I, Thought that, oh, well, I'll chase her to Paris. That's romantic. Very romantic. Uh, um, yeah, you get her on the plane. They're like, no, you can't go through. And you go, but it's for love. They go, this way, monsieur. Right. Well, uh, yeah. <laughs> yes. Yeah, you spend a few nights in jail and everything's Right, right, right. And you're in Paris. And uh, she, she had met another guy by the time I got there. Oh, this is awful. Yeah. It was, a French guy? Yeah. Oh, know, what a bastard. I, I yeah. know. <laughs> you know, they're waiting at the airport. Hello, are you lonely? Yes. Yes. <laughs> Do you need someone to listen to you? Yes. <laughs> That she fell right, right, right for it. She was, uh, yeah, a baggage, a baggage, bag checker that she met. Um, no, he was, uh, he was like a. Vi it was the worst thing. He was a classical violinist. Oh, that's awful, man. And, uh, yeah, and you know, so I, I, when she opened the door, I knew not just because he was standing there angrily, <laughs> uh, naked. Oh. No, uh, no, I could tell something had, had, had gone wrong. And so I cried for days in, in all the, the national monuments in the, in, in the, in the Père Lachaise, Notre Dame. I just, I wept and then she sent me home. And uh, so I was eaten alive by, by Paris, basically. It was, and, and that's, that, and how the hell did you get together with her then after that? Um, well, I just, I kind of forced, I, f I proposed, to, I cornered her and I forced her <laughs> Into marrying me, basically. What do you uh, have some uh, I'm very information on her or something like that? You... I'm very, I'm very, I'm very muscular, uh, and I just I'm... did a little. You know, you don't want to mess with a with a guy with a hairy back. Yeah, I'm very unpredictable. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> And uh, I just, I proposed to her in, and it was way too fast. I shouldn't have, everyone said, wait, wait, don't, don't do this. And uh, I'd like, you know, it was basically like I picked her up from the airport and had to pull over and just propose in a car because I, I couldn't wait because I also knew it was sort of like entrapping her, you know, once I, once I did that. I know so you could hear her while she's still woozy with the jet lag right. as well, yeah. <laughs> Yes. Um, so you know, it was it was sneaky of me. I, I just I really wanted her, and I I, I didn't want anything. Didn't uh, he, she can't be with a French guy, right? No, That's, no, of course not. They, no, it's I, a ludicrous I, idea. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And in, in France, like they all, everybody should. Oh, should they, do. they all do this. They they like won't finish a sentence. They'll be like, it's like. Eh, pff, eh, pff, eh. They always do that. Eh, pff, eh, pff. You know, I'm joining eh, in with you. I got it. I yeah, got yeah, it. You know, it's. Eh, pff, eh. <laughs> They do that all the time. I don't know what that emotion is. It's pure indifference. Frenchness, that's yeah. what it is, yeah. Well, so anyway, you get rid of the French guy. We're totally out of time, but <laughs> I, I'm very interested in this. Well, all right then. Yeah, well, I'll, yeah. We we can finish the the story. I, I we did get married, so no, it's, it's, it's happy it, it was it was a very clumsy road uh, getting there. Thanks to, to and me. how long have you been married? Uh, we have been married for six years. Oh well, it's fine. It'll take now. It's it's yeah yeah yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's fine. And you've we, got a, you've got a kid together. Yeah, we're we're in You're the fine. clear, right? Like, yeah, yeah, nothing could possibly go wrong. <laughs> <laughs> And you have to ominously chew on your pipe. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, you'll be fine. Just don't go to Paris. Uh, no, clearly. Because there's going to be... <laughs> you get off the plane. Yeah, you'll be waiting there with this violin. And yeah, these, all these pantsless men with perfectly groomed backs. <laughs> <laughs> Simon Hillberg, everybody. Tonight on the show, we're very excited, aren't we? We have Simon Helberg and Kunal Nayar from The Big Bang Theory. <laughs> except, except, I don't think one of them is Kunal Nayar. <laughs> Go and check. <laughs> That's what I thought. Off you go. Uh, when I tap you on the shoulder, please state your name and where you're from. I'm a Lok and I'm from India, New Delhi. <laughs> New Delhi, India. 
Well, that doesn't make you Kunal Nayar, though. It's in the same place. But it doesn't. But it doesn't. But it doesn't make me. <laughs> happens all the time. Yeah. <clears throat> that was that Indian guy that was here about a month ago. You remember that guy? <laughs> all right. All right, like, like I, I've just pulled you out of the audience, that's the thing, all right? Here's the scene. You're a member of the public, mm. I've pulled you out of the audience, your name's Simon Helmberg, you maybe have a project coming okay. up, and you want to plug it. <clears throat> when I tap you on the shoulder, please state your name and where you're from. I am Simon Helberg. I am from Los Angeles, California. I see. And why would you be here in the audience this evening? I am here for the plug of my movie, I Am I. It is in select theaters in Los Angeles and New York, and on demand, and on iTunes, and I could go on and on. <laughs> why isn't it in movie theaters in, like, Chicago and stuff? <laughs> well, uh... Is it one of them independent movies? Where people have feelings and no one chases anyone in a car? Is that the kind of movie we're talking about? <laughs> so let me get this straight. There's no aliens in this movie, is there? Illegal aliens? No, oh, no, that's not the same. He's fine. He's absolutely fine. We checked. Everything's cool. So, no one... Blows up the White House, no one, you know, attacks anybody, nobody does anything. It's just like people having feelings and sorting stuff out. Just emotional explosion. Right, right. <laughs> well, it sounds good. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, I, I should see. I am I. Why is it called I am I? Uh, it is a reference to uh, Man of La Mancha, the I am I Don Quixote. Yeah, well, I don't go much for the book learning, <laughs> son. I know, that's why it's not in Chicago. Yeah. Uh, what are you talking about? <laughs> Chicago's a big city. Why, what am oh, I... yeah. oh, so you got snippy with me all of a sudden. <laughs> Look, you're the one that sat in the audience of my show to plug your movie. I was forced by an Indian. He told me he was Kunal, and he said if we could live somewhere for a month together, and it was air-conditioned, and... Here we are. It's been a great last month. Well... <laughs> it's gonna be a great show, everybody! Simon Helberg, everybody! Simon Helberg. Yeah, we still got it. Come <laughs> on, yeah. Never been twirled by such a, a tall man. Yeah, well, my yeah. shoulder sorry, cuffs. I, sorry, my shoulder cuffs. Does that sound like I know what I'm talking about? I just... Your shoulder cuff? Did yeah. You, uh, do you know? Uh, do you know anything about the human body? I, doctorly wise. I, I know. Are you a doctor? I well, I, I've played. I've played doctor. <laughs> but you're not actually a doctor. No, I'm not a doctor. I... Like Doctor Phil. Right, not, not a doctor. Not actually a doctor. But successful. Right. But very successful. And, has and on TV. Right. Right, so you, in fact, you could be Dr. Phil. I'm not going to comment either way. Okay. <laughs> How are you doing? It's good to see you. Oh, it's good to see you too. <clears throat> I was just, you know, I, just, I didn't know by running in here that I was going to be serenaded such... With such a such a sweet sweet dance moves, my God! No, 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 no! I just I, I just felt organic. You ran in. It looked like you had a lot of energy about you. I thought, well, I'll dance with the young fella and see what his moves are like. I must <laughs> must be honest. I'm a little disappointed. I thought you'd have been better, but I hear that okay. from, hear that from most people. But you know, you? <laughs> I knew I'd get a little sympathy. No. That's the whole, that's your, oper that's the way you operate. A, you go I'm for the sympathy, then boom. Master manipulator. Yes, and then in to the, in, yeah, exactly. <laughs> and then it, and then it's hands on boobies. Yeah. Yeah. Huh. Is that how you, is that how you met your wife? You manipulated her? Man, manip, manipulated her? Manip, manipulated? Yeah. No, you can't, you can you say nipples? Uh, on... I didn't say that. I, I said no, that. I'm just, I'm just wondering if oh. you could say nipples on. Uh, All right. I can th you? I think it's a requirement. I, uh, that's, yeah. I have a quota, so. You have a quota? A nipple quota. <laughs> how, how many, how many do you have? 
Uh, nipples. On, on never, no, yeah, yeah, how many nipples? Uh, I, I was born with, with the standard. Three? <laughs> it's normal then, right? Yeah, yeah, I've got three and then one round the back. Oh, good. <laughs> That's, that's Do you have any physical abnormalities you're deeply ashamed of and you don't want anyone to know about? <laughs> well, you promise you won't tell? Absolutely. Okay. Uh, no, I'm pretty perfect. I, uh... Oh, really? <laughs> you're, you're, you don't have any uh, body image problems? Or... I mean, I have I'll... body image. I'm not a huge fan always of what I see when I walk past a mirror, if that means... But I don't, I don't think that's a clinical thing. I think it's... Well, I don't know. I think that, you know, you've got to look at accepting yourself for who you are. That's a way to happiness. You start, you know, worrying about things you can't change, you get in trouble. It's true. I mean, but... See, I, I'm like Dr. Phil, too. I, yeah. yeah. <laughs> feeling, feeling better already. Yeah. I, yes, I, I mean, there are things. I have like a... What do they call... It's, it's not a birthmark, but it's like a, a, a strawberry or something. Oh, like, a hideous growth? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, lots of flies around it all. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Something that you scarred you when you had to change in front of the other kids at PE. <laughs> yes, well, I, I, it, I didn't. We didn't change that. That whole, that's a mystery to me. I didn't. Our PE was very. I never got like. I hadn't have. Where did you go to school? I went to like a liberal. Ah, uh, you see, you got to go to a school where they torture and humiliate you for years. <laughs> well, that's where I went, and look how sane I turned out. <laughs> Smoking a pipe with no tobacco. Well, now that is sane. That is. Yeah, yeah, because, right. Let's you know. be smart. Yeah, you know. Do you ever smoke tobacco? I, I, I mean, I've, I've smoked tobacco. I haven't really smoked uh, pipes, but I remember a kid in high school, he, he got like uh, some kind of strawberry, it's a strawberry is a theme, strawberry yeah. flavored tobacco, and, and he thought it was very, very It's cool, always one kid. It's the kid that wears 16. the trilby yeah. and, uh, yeah, smokes the pipe. 16, it's weird yeah. to sneak out back. If I caught my 16-year-old son with a pipe, I, I don't know if I'd even get mad about the smoking. Just be disappointed in his pretentiousness. No. <laughs> Sorry. No, you, you make a point. I, uh, <clears throat> I think if I saw my, one of my kids smoking a pipe, I, if, as long as it wasn't crack or any drugs... Right. Uh, a I'd peace think, pipe. A peace pipe. I think, well, maybe it was a peace pipe or maybe they were solving crimes. Oh. <laughs> If they had a monocle. Yeah, but no, I always think monocle as a comedy Nazi. Monocle is comedy Nazi, like, ah, oh, now hold on, and that's then... True. That's true, that it, there is, and that's all, it's also like a hipster thing now, that monocles... Hipsters are, are wearing monocles? They're, they're coming oh, back. Oh, enough already, hipsters! I, I, look, I, it's, they're just totally regressing to Civil War era. That's, that's not, I mean, I've seen the waxed moustaches yes. and the bicycles with a big front right. wheel and all that, but no monocles? Well, what was missing from that? Well, monocle? this is ridiculous. Come on! Maybe they have... You, you, you're a representative of the hipster nation. I, you should have a word. I, well, I didn't know. I hope I'm not. I'm trying to just speak. But I think you are quite hip. I, I have like a subtle, a subtle mustache. Well, also you're, you're thin and successful and, you know, that's... <laughs> Well, uh, is, is success a hipster? I thought the hipsters are like... Well, no, not they really. They, 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 they re refuse to, to conform, I thought. that was. I think they conform a great deal with each other. I think that's what it is. Yes, they might. I do. I have eaten... I ate kale You today. eat kale? I, I'm sorry. I, that, I, yeah, and my mustache came free with, with the kale. With the kale? Yeah. <laughs> so I, I, couldn't, I couldn't resist. But I, it's actually all right. I just hate all the fuss about I don't, it. I'm not, I wouldn't have a book about it, uh, you know. But I, it's pretty, it's self-explanatory what, what you do with kale. You, what you, the hell, man? <laughs> yeah, man. I, Damn can't. hipster. How dare he? Yeah, no, he, he'll take his monocle off and bid you adieu. Yeah. <laughs> no, well, he's, so, listen, to, he's already done it, he's bid you adieu, that's wow. it. No, there's no coming back from that. <laughs> oh, Jeff. Oh. <laughs> Finally, my own show. <laughs> you can have it. <laughs> um, tell me about your film now, young fella. Tell me about the film. Um, <coughs> the film is uh, my wife wrote and directed. Oh, yeah, no, that film I do want to hear about. Yes. But tell me about oh. the film 
Uh, How to Train Your Dragon 2, which is in theaters oh, now. That's America's a, family favorite. One I'm not in. You just want to hear about it. But, but, I, but I'm in that. Oh, you were in it? Yeah, yeah. Oh, but you'd like me to tell you about the experience. I just thought you might want to mention it. Now, tell me about your film. Oh, okay, gosh. Uh, well, yeah, so that uh, the film is called I Am I, and my wife uh, wrote, uh, directed, produced, and starred in it, and I, I Ooh, have a part so in it. You're in it? I, I am in she it. She directs it? She directed me. Um, okay. which, yeah, well... <laughs> But I got paid this time for her to tell me what to do. You know? Right. So she, she's kind. She, she's, she's gentle. Um, the movie's great, though. Um, it's, a, it's about a girl who, uh, at her mother's funeral, meets the father she never knew. And it turns out that he is suffering from uh, this retrograde amnesia where he thinks he's 34. And he mistakes. I've met a lot of guys like yeah, that. Yeah, I think yeah. it's just being... I, think I, it's I might be that guy, actually, yeah. yeah. Uh, and he mistakes his uh, daughter for his his dead wife because he she looks like a. Well, this person. is getting complicated. It gets uh, a little, a little bit. And uh, and then he starts to court her, and she allows that and pretends to be her mother in order to get to know him. It's not a, does it, It's not a very. It's not super dark. I know it sounds like it could go that way. It sounds a little weird. It, it sounds does. A little, sounds a little weird. It's uh, but you know. Now your wife uh, clearly has some issues and problems. Uh, <laughs> She calls me daddy, but... Yeah, yeah well, that's... At uh, uh, any particular time, or...? <laughs> that's when I'm changing her. Uh... <laughs> oh, yeah, man! Sorry. You went there, you went dark, you went super dark! <laughs> yeah! Woo. Look at you, Mr. Smorgasbord Primetime TV! <laughs> It's all right, man. You're amongst friends here. Yeah. That's good. Last time you turned your backs on me, you guys. Yeah, man. This guy took us to school, Jeff. <laughs> he took us to school. Whatever, man. <laughs> oh. Jeff, stop bidding him adieu. <laughs> well, you really upset him. That's the cold shoulder. Yeah, yeah. yeah how, how you like the view? <laughs> like what you see? Want to taste? <laughs> this is creepy, man. Yeah. Yeah, it is kind of creepy. I quite like being back here. <laughs> I've heard that before. Uh, hey! hey! Prime time! How are things going in the old uh, large bang theory? Uh, they, are, they are good. We are on, we are on hiatus. Se uh, is season 28? Season 28 yeah. Or like yeah, we're skipping right to season 28. And uh, the kid from Two and a Half Men is on the show now, right? <laughs> He plays my father. <laughs> no, uh, yeah, it's 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 guy. It is really flying. It's a by. huge thing. It's a big I mean, show. It's, like it's a really big. See, the thing is, when you're in a big show like that, I w I've never been in one, but I imagine it may take over your life a little bit. <laughs> it does. Although you know, it's like sometimes I think, oh, I, can't, I just can't go anywhere without people. Even if I put on a hat. Well, today I was sitting in my car um, outside of Starbucks, about to go in. I was getting off the phone, and a lady comes up and she's like, oh, "Okay, can I just?" And I was like, I, I'm, "I'm sorry," and she's like, eh, "And I rolled down the window." And I was like, yes. And she said, are you a taxi? Can I take a taxi? <laughs> and I'm, I mean, I, I drive a yellow cab, but I... Yeah, uh, right. No. You should have uh, you, you taken I was, me somewhere. I really should have yeah. done... It's the Bill Murray thing to do. That's the, Yeah, just, Bill Murray would have done that. You welcome that into... I mean, and I, I could have made some money also, or I could have been <laughs> hacked up into small pieces. I don't know. Ah, come on. It's a lady she, looking for a taxi. A, That's a sweet old. lady, but I was in a non-cab looking auto, and it was... I've got to say that a lot of people have said this to me. You do kind of look a little bit like a cab driver. Really? <laughs> Like a nice cab driver. A lot of people. Like, well, I, only one old lady ever said it to me. <laughs> I saw her. Yeah, yeah, outside Starbucks. Yeah, that's yeah. the one. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh well, you know, I could, I could, uh, yeah. So I could do the. What, what was that? What? Someone beeped. Someone beeped. I think it's the commercial. It's Michael's watch telling us it's the commercial uh, break. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Well. It's very subtle. Yeah. <laughs> I think, he, I think he's upset because oh. he's a hipster as well. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Tell the black frames. Oh, no! Oh, you're kidding me again! Yeah. yeah. Oh, my God. We'll be right back, everybody. We'll be right back. Uh, Simon Helberg and uh, we were talking about stuff. Yep. <laughs> to be honest, it's not going that well. He's, he's a little angry at Jeff. Jeff's a little angry at him. I'm a little confused because I thought we were having a good time, but apparently not. 
<laughs> not at all. It's cool, man. We're all good, man. We're all good. No, no, we're, we're not. We're not all good. I think we should talk about it. I think we should talk about our feelings. Now, uh, let's start with you, Simon. All right. You came to the show. At, are you smelling your finger? No, I'm trying not. You were smelling your little finger. You were. You were. It's my wedding finger. It's... You smell your wedding. Oh, that's your. Uh, yeah. That's your wedding ring. I can tell if things are good at home. That, okay, yeah, this is... No, no, no let's no, no, stay no, here. No. <laughs> yeah. Let's stay right here. I... No, no, let's not. It's fine. <laughs> do you want a piece of my pipe? I do, thank you. There you go. Oh, this is... Yeah, I like, so I'm going to smoke it like this now. <laughs> Make my face look bigger. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this looks like a, a part of Jeff. I'm not going to... I think it is. Yeah, why don't you... Why don't you... Hey, come hey, hey, come yeah. on. Why don't you show me All what right. part that is? <laughs> Come over here and put it back on me. <laughs> uh, oh, dear. At least he said on and not So, in. listen, uh, your, uh, your wife directs you in this film, right? Did you, did you meet her at uh, show business or did you meet at her show, somewhere real? The University of Show Business. Yeah. Uh, well, kind of. I, no, I, we went to a high school, uh, the high school, the same high school. But, really? Was she your teacher? Uh, <laughs> Oh, that would have been so cool. That would be pretty Although, hot. You remember that was that hot for teacher? Yeah. Oh man, remember that? Yeah, yeah. but my teachers weren't. They were not. Uh, no, mine neither. They were uh, abusive alcoholics. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It was. Uh, it, she. She was. She was a student, but we didn't know each other. And I met her later at a housewarming party, and I thought we hit it off well. And then I. It, she made me work very hard. She really. I. It was. It was. I, I can. I can charm a girl, like in a, about a two minute, two to three minutes. That's sort of the threshold for then they are done with my then, company. Oh, wow. Uh, um, and, she, and then she was sort of done. And I you had, must have been crazy for her then to keep going through. Did you follow her around a lot? <laughs> well, I mean, you know, she didn't always see me, but I was there. <laughs> you know, you're giving hope to every creepy stalker in America right now. I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You went dark, man. I, I went just, dark. I didn't, I, it's, uh, yeah, so, um, uh, yeah, but eventually she, she gave in. <laughs> Doesn't it sound romantic? And, uh, uh, yeah, we were, you know, it's a very incestuous, I grew up in L.A., so a lot of people stay here and end up marrying each other and, and. Uh, that happens in many towns. I guess so. Yeah, I you guess. know, people, uh, you know, from the same town marry right. each other and have children and, That's you true. know, life goes, hakuna matata, my friend, That's, you know, yeah. circle of life. I sang that at our wedding. Did, what? No, I, what are you crazy? <laughs> Just trying to did you sing at your wedding? No, God, no. Sing at my wedding. Well, you, what did you do then? Tap dance? You must have done something. Did a you soft do a little, shoe. Yeah, a soft shoe? Yeah, no, I did, I, we just, we, we did some, some vows, but they were kind of unique and nice. I, you hipster bastard. Yeah. <laughs> Instead of rings, we presented each other with monocles. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> or, and then we poked out the glass. And, yeah, you know, poked out the glass, <laughs> put the monocle on, had a little kale. And yeah. uh, like, what about the, uh, where did you get married then? Um, at her uncle's house uh, in uh, the Pacific Palisades. Oh, that's quite. That's rather nice over there. It was. Yeah, yeah it was. It was. It was beautiful, and uh, it was a. Yeah, it was a lovely. We got married on seven seven seven, which was a very popular. Yeah. Because uh, it's lucky, right? Sure. <laughs> so far, so good. How long have you been married now? Uh, seven years. Yeah, that's right. Wow. See how that's. That works? Uh, yeah, I, I know now. Yeah. Yeah. Many kids you got? I have two. Yeah, right. That's it's intense. Oh man. I, we won't talk about. Kids. I know you're. You, who wants to come? You come here probably to have, you know, some time with your with your friend Jeff and away from, from kids yelling. I, uh, right. What the hell is wrong with you, man? I'm just. I'm trying to. I'm trying to cut you a little slack. No, no, no. You can talk about your kids. It's no. all right. What age are they? Well, they uh, they're they're two and five weeks. Five weeks. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so sorry, man. I, I had no idea. I, you see why I went dark? Yeah, then? yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I understand. You haven't slept in a very long time. I totally five weeks. Gosh, it's intense. Let's just stay out of the house for a little longer then. Uh, I, that's why. Yeah. I yeah. Got, no, I hear you. You know what I, I'm saying? You know yes. when you go on the you go to Rite Aid, you got to pick up like paper towels, and it, you spend like three hours. Oh yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. Oh, there was something else I had to get. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just like to. I'm like, well, the double ply paper towel. The bounty is probably not organic. And I, I, I don't say the names of the products, please. Sorry. 
I, I love I love all, all I love all house. American products. <laughs> Well, we're out of time, Simon. Okay. You gotta go back and take care of the kids again. <laughs> just, just another five minutes. No, sorry. <laughs> okay. No, uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's lovely to see you as always. I, not as much you, but it is lovely to see you. <laughs> I understand, and with that, we'll bid you adieu. Simon <laughs> And may I say, I think you look splendid. I like your cardigan and your hair. Thank you. It's a, they no, came together. Well, it's, it's really lovely. Your, your cardigan looks like relaxed and your hair is like, you're, it's a swoop. Yes. It's, um, a, it's, a, it's a party on top and a... And, and a, a party and a, down, but it's a party all over. Well, That's what it is. I'm, you I, look like you should smoke a pipe. I do, don't I? Well, No, you can't oh. have this. No, this has got my cooties on it. I don't know if we've got another one. All right. I'd like to watch, you know. Do you? It's creepy, right? Do you, do you like to watch? I mean, sexually, do you enjoy that? Well, when you, when you say it in a card, anything you say in a cardigan becomes a lot creepier, doesn't it? I feel like... <laughs> a little bit, actually, yes, when I think about it. Also, my mustache makes everything much creepier. It does. You're becoming just a mustache. You're, you're, so, you're so thin, and I think it's... I've become a vegan. I, that's what I heard. Yes, I've tried vegan cheese, and it makes me say Louisville. Uh, I'm not a vegan. I have, I have dabbled. It, it kind of it, it hurts a little bit sometimes, all that roughage and... Uh, and all those, those. Are we talking about a diet or some kind of sex? No, I was yeah. <laughs> taken advantage of. It's because of the cardigan. No, no, so too. what you're saying is that you tried being I've, a vegan and it made you gassy? Well, I mean, I occasionally dabble in, in what, what your kind. Uh, My kind? How dare you? I'm sorry, it's just... But I, yeah, my, my wife, um, she has a lot of uh, interesting dietary things, and she was vegan. She makes you do stuff? She kind Your of, wife <laughs> makes you do stuff. Yeah, she just, she pulls the fork out of my hand and says, here, have this kale colossus. Yeah, yeah. Um, and, uh, and she, but she was raw one time, and now she's, she's doing this thing. She needs uh, more protein than, than other folks might, so she, she bought cricket flour. Uh, What's that? Well, it's. Uh, I thought it was, you know, maybe for you made it for crickets. I thought like, well, or or it's from England. You go, it's right. like cricket flower. Yes, yes. really... On the field, yes. yeah. So we call it cricket flower because it's white, like yes, the it's trousers little... we wear <laughs> when we play cricket. A snuff of cricket flower. <laughs> yes. Okay. That's much better now. Thank you. Yeah. So now this is actually to bake with, and it has cricket. It has ground up. Ground crickets. up crickets? I know. Don't yell at me. What? I know. That's like the opposite of being a vegan. It, no, it is. And so she's, she's made cricket pancakes. What? Uh, I know. Silent green is people! <laughs> And they're not, I thought they were going to be little pancakes for, for crickets. I thought yeah. it was very sweet. I thought it was, you know, it was, it was an altruistic sort of, let's lay out some pancakes. It's, no, it's there, there are dead crickets. How um, many crickets have to die for your pancake obsession? I, I think, like Gandhi said, one cricket is too many. Yes, it is. I, I, that's, uh, do so you, do you, ever, do you still, it. do you hear the crickets, Simon? <laughs> late at night. <laughs> do you so, hear the... Oh, I see their eyes, a cricket eyes. Cricket eyes, yeah. Um, Have you ever played cricket? No, I, I don't, I'm a little afraid. That's, do you get on a horse to do that? No, 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 no that's, oh, that's polo. Oh. No, no, cricket is a... Uh, <laughs> I don't know what you're worried about. It's not a real horse. I, uh, look, I, 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 to me it looks real. I, I don't go near horses, but that's as real as any horse I've ever, I've ever seen. You really know nothing about horses. Anyway, look. No. No, uh, cricket is a game uh, a little bit like, sort of like, uh, it's a combination of baseball and mathematics. Ah. Yeah. Uh, so you hold a, a big pencil. And well, you, well, it's sort of, and you, you, you crack a little thing, and, it, and then you run up and down. And, uh, right. It's very big in, in the UK, right? It's, it's, uh, yes, and in lots of places that used to be parts of the British Empire. So it's very big in India, and it's very big in the West Indies, and it's very big in so that's South why Africa, you, you pegged Australia. For, for a cricket player. Hmm? Yeah, that's why you pegged me for a cricket player. Well, I thought you might, you know, it's an interesting interesting game. I, I'm not, uh, despite this, this look, I'm not as athletic as, as you might think. You don't play any sports at all? 
I, uh, jeez. Do you no. watch any sports? That's too much athleticism. I, I start sweating just watching. I can't. <laughs> well, then, what do you watch on television when you get the children away to bed? Um, what do I Porn? watch? Porn? Porn, you say? <laughs> <laughs> you mind reader, you. <laughs> Am I red? No. <laughs> <clears throat> no, I, I don't. I, 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 would like, I would like to see cricket. Can, what channel? It's probably harder to find than porn these days, isn't it? <laughs> Much harder to find than porn. Yeah. Could they, could porn they... is just like you just turn on the TV and just porn just pours yeah. out of you. It's no, like yeah. porn now is like maple syrup in Canada. It's just pouring out of this. It's, it's... pouring everywhere. It's yeah. like, did you see Kim Kardashian's ass? I, I, I looked out my window and... The, you kind of... <laughs> It is more difficult to not see that ass than it is to see that ass. Tell me about it. I, I know. I, I, try, I try to avert my eyes. It's like an eclipse. And, and, and you, 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 you don't want to look, but you, you can't help but look. Yeah. But then you go blind. And, uh, well, uh, yeah. But the thing is, uh, an eclipse only happens, you know, once every right. you know, two, three, uh, two, three months, two, three this years. Is common so, yeah. as the, yeah, this sunrise. Yeah, this is more like sunrise, sunset. Yes. You know, uh, yes. Well... We can we can only do our best. Do you uh, do you ever get trapped? Like sometimes, like my wife might say to me, "Did you does that look good to you?" Uh, oh. And I'm like, "I don't I don't know." You don't know what the yeah, right. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I think the right answer is always no. It looks it's yeah, or <laughs> it's dis disgusting. <laughs> I always try no to one. say D -d -d <laughs> yeah no I no mean, but, no. Yeah, you have to try to fish. Yeah around. yeah yeah. What, what are you looking for? Yeah yeah yeah. yeah. Like yeah. in the clip. Uh, yeah exactly yeah, like in the clip. Gonna... Yeah it's 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 a tough road to. Uh, to, to navigate down, you don't want to. I thought you were going to say it's a tough road to hoe, and then I was like, I, I didn't. Don't say hoe. No, well, you can't say Kim Kardashian and hoe. No, 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 no. You must. No, we must be careful not to. You must be careful not to shame someone for for this. I think for a public display. Public displays of nudity. Right. If, if that's what she wants to do, that's fine. It's no, okay. I, there is but, there's but, integrity there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I think she was pouring champagne, right? Which is a very distinguished act. Champagne is the the beverage of the. Gods. Of the buns. Yeah. <laughs> Have you ever had champagne? No. Yeah. Well, yeah. Who hasn't had? It's not like cricket. Here, champagne is easy. Yeah. Easy I don't know. And I, I, whenever I drank, even because I drank a lot when I drank, and yeah. whenever I drank champagne, I didn't care for it. It's very. I feel like the drunk is like the 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 lick. It's a very bubbly drunk. You. I always. I get very sort of loose and. You know. That's I not what it did for me at all. Car, no. No. I need a friend, Craig. Well. Well, then champagne is your friend. Okay. Well, I, I, uh, I yeah, I, I feel uh, it's, it's definitely a privileged sort of life. To, you get yes, drunk on champagne, yeah. it's... I don't... What will you get drunk on, then? Anything. I'm a, I'm a lightweight. I, I uh, you know, I, I can... You don't drink at all anymore. Not anymore. Uh, at the request of a few ex-wives and some law enforcement agencies. <laughs> uh, yeah. yeah. It's a subtle okay, hint. Like, we, we, we got together and we all think, you know, best if you don't drink it. Right. Have as many cricket pancakes as you like, yeah. but don't. It was an intervention, but you were in a kind jail cell. Kind of a little bit, but right. you're not a big wild man for that. Well, you've got young children. I, you know. I do. I do have young children. They're, they're wild enough for me. My, yeah, my daughter is going through a, a I hope it's a, a phase. <laughs> Do you, do you have a pet? <laughs> well, ever since they took my daughter away... Oh, I, come on now! Uh, I have three uh, cats, um, male really? cats. They're, 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 they're boys. Uh, she's not as fast so as... I don't either. want to talk about your cat's penis. I'm trying but to steer you... Why do they have bigger... Penis? All right, we'll be right back with Simon Helberg. Welcome back, everyone. Welcome back to Pipe Smoking Tonight. <laughs> With my special guest, Simon Helberg, who smokes a pipe. Mm. Yeah. <coughs> Simon, do you find that pipes help you solve crimes? Uh, well, it's, uh, <coughs> uh, it becomes a little more tricky because uh, uh, the smoke clouds my vision and... Uh, is your pipe... Is your pipe stuck it's inside stuck your my, mouth? Yeah. It is. It's stuck in my braces. <clears throat> <laughs> Do you know what I just noticed? Somebody left. Yeah. Look, look over there. Somebody, we've had a walkout. 
I do that to people. <laughs> what? That's because of that thing you said that we edited for taste. <laughs> yeah. I think they went to, to go get some cricket pancakes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> hey, um, we're out of time. Oh, you came back and gave me a pipe and now you're kicking me, <laughs> kicking me off? I can't tell you how many times I've heard that. Ah, well. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell is that you're doing with your mouth? Wow. The, you know, when you That's good. Do that again. Whoa! <laughs> Man! That looks but like look a kind of thing that you could adapt and... and oh. Just apply it to, uh... Microfiche? Yes. <laughs> so to speak. Yes, well, um... When I finger my way through that, I... Okay. <laughs> You, you, you. Come here. He just kissed my ear. I didn't know. It's a little bit dirty. You're being a little bit dirty. <laughs> You're the one who handed me this phallus. No, it's not a phallus. Come on, man. All right, man. Yeah, relax. Has this been in other people's... <laughs> I just... Say it. No, I just don't, you know... Has it been in other people's mouths? When a strange man comes up and, and hands you an object like this and... <laughs> Tells you to suck on it. I'd just like to know where it's, where it's been first. <laughs> but I'll go with the flow. And that's what's going to get you into trouble. <laughs> we have to go. Okay, we can go. We can go. Oh. Yes? <coughs> There's not even any tobacco in it. It's resin or something. Oh, right, okay. I want to shamelessly uh, plug a, a movie that I'm going to be in that's coming out on January 23rd, and it's, it's called... Why? Well, it. yeah, it's shameless plug, but it's called We'll Never Have Paris, and it's, it's a hilarious uh, story of all of, of my disastrous foibles with women based on the story of me and my wife and how I uh, self-destructed. Is this a plug or actually the, the synopsis no, of the entire movie? This is the film. All right. Uh, so, yeah, go see it. It's, all it's, right, uh, go see Simon and we'll... We'll, ne we'll never have Paris. We'll never have Paris. All right, Simon. Yeah.